Antler lists hunting license go on sale tomorrow. The game commission faced some heat last year after its online system went down during the first day of sales. So what changes are coming? Evan Popalich joins us now live with more on this story. Yeah, Valerie, the Game Commission took a big swing last year to make buying hunting licenses easier. Well, there were some hiccups with that, so more changes have now been made to try to alleviate headaches. People were on edge a little bit more. Last year was the first major change in decades to buying hunting licenses in Pennsylvania. It didn't go well. Got my doe tag, my license. Waited two and a half hours, but uh, it was worth it. I would say we would probably have over 100 people in line. We did have um, significant wait times on the first day of sales last year. One year later, the eve of antlerless license is going on sale with more changes. There's a, a staggered start this year that so far has worked well to, to manage crowds. License sales went live in three wildlife management units on Monday for more of the hotbed areas to hunt in the state. I do think that the three wildlife management units that went on sale Monday uh, will alleviate some of the pressure that's going to be tomorrow. Travis Lau with the Game Commission believes the online system for purchasing license has improved. He says getting doe tags won't be a race this year. Those three WMUs were first come first serve and the, the rest are, are guaranteed to resident hunters for 11 days. The deadline 7 a.m. on July 8th. The Game Commission not worrying about overselling licenses. Even if we were to sell more than the allocated number than that that allocation total we would continue to sell them oversell that total with adjustments made next year depending on the deer population 164,000 antlerless licenses were purchased on opening day last year even with the changes Kinsey's Outdoors and Mount Joy is preparing for a large crowd tomorrow we're going to implement a number system so I'm going to go out in the morning about 7 30 before we open at 8 and hand everyone a number and one of the wildlife management units that went on sale Monday has already sold out with another one expected to sell out pretty soon. Live in Lancaster County, Evan Bapalis, ABC 27 News.